Did you know that 19.7% of heart attacks occur without any warning signs? You might feel perfectly healthy, ace your annual checkup, and still face a life-threatening event tomorrow? How is this possible? The answer lies in a silent threat lurking within your arteries. Inflammation. Hello, I'm Dr. Sarah Johnson, and today I'm unveiling the number one hidden trigger behind most heart attacks. It's not what you might expect. It's not high cholesterol or severely blocked arteries. Instead, it's a subtle process that could be happening inside your body right now without you even realizing it. Arterial inflammation. The silent killer. Let's dive into the heart of the matter. Arterial inflammation. This insidious condition slowly damages your blood vessels from the inside out. They can rupture at any moment, potentially leading to a sudden and devastating heart attack. And here's something that might surprise you. It doesn't take a 90% blockage to cause problems. Even if your blood sugar looks normal, chronically elevated insulin levels can fuel inflammation throughout your body, including in your arteries. Even arteries with just 40% unstable plaques can spell disaster. When you're stressed, your body releases cortisol. This hormone doesn't just make you feel frazzled, it raises your blood pressure, makes your blood thicker, and inflames your blood vessels. It's a triple threat to your heart health, creates microscopic fissures in your artery walls, providing the perfect entry point for cholesterol to sneak in. Your body sensing danger triggers an immune response. In an attempt to patch up these tiny wounds, it forms plaques. Research shows that sleep deprivation can increase your inflammation markers by a staggering 40 to 50%. That's right. Skimping on sleep isn't just making you tired. It's actively inflaming your arteries. Refined carbohydrates, industrial seed oils, and added sugars are all major culprits. Even that healthy granola bar you're snacking on could be loaded with these inflammation-triggering ingredients. Here's the scary truth. You can have pristine scans and textbook perfect cholesterol levels it still be at significant risk. Why? Because most doctors don't routinely test for inflammation. That's why so many people seem to die from heart attacks out of the blue. It's also why traditional tests often fail to catch the problem until it's too late. Now that you understand the real threat, you can take action to protect yourself. In the next part of this series, I'll show you exactly how to do that. Let's break down the five biggest triggers that most people are completely unaware of chronic gum disease, underlying gut issues, and even the air pollution you breathe every day can silently inflame your arteries? Here's what you can look forward to. You'll discover how to eat your way to a healthier heart without feeling deprived. These are on your standard tests. They are specific markers that can uncover hidden inflammation before it's too late. These seemingly unrelated health issues could be putting your heart at risk without you even realizing it. It's a silent threat that doesn't cause pain and doesn't show up on standard tests until it's too late. But here's the kicker. These plaques aren't stable. Why it's so dangerous now, you might be thinking, but I just had a clean bill of health from my doctor. You have the power to take control of your heart health starting right now. They might show that your arteries aren't severely blocked, but they can't reveal the unstable plaques that could rupture at any moment. Take care, and I'll see you in part two together. We'll unmask the silent killer of arterial inflammation and build a stronger, healthier heart. Your future self will thank you for taking this step today. It's hidden causes of inflammation. It's not because their health suddenly took a nosedive overnight. It's because this silent inflammation had been building up for years, weakening their arteries and setting the stage for disaster. So what's causing this dangerous inflammation? 1. Insulin resistance. Long before you're diagnosed with diabetes, your body might already be struggling with insulin. Two, chronic stress, we all know stress isn't great for us, but did you know it's actively damaging your heart? Three, processed foods you might think you're eating healthy, but many so-called health foods are actually inflammatory bombs. More triggers we ignore for poor sleep. If you're consistently getting less than six hours of sleep a night, listen up. Five, hidden infections, some threats to your heart health are truly invisible. The silent buildup here sweat makes arterial inflammation so insidious. This damaging process can go on for years without causing any pain or noticeable symptoms. Think about it. How many times have you heard of someone who seemed perfectly healthy one day only to suffer a massive heart attack the next? This is why relying solely on standard cholesterol tests or stress tests can give you a false sense of security. These tests don't tell the whole story. 
It's like having a ticking time bomb in your body that standard medical tests can't detect. And that's terrifying. But knowledge is power. Coming up in part two in our next video, I'll equip you with the tools you need to fight back against this silent killer. I'll reveal the three critical blood tests that your doctor absolutely must check. You'll learn simple, practical habits that can actually reverse arterial inflammation. These are changes anyone can make starting today. I'll share a list of powerful foods and nutrients that can protect your heart for life. Do all miss part two of this series? Because the information I'll share could literally save your life. Remember, 19.7% of heart attacks strike without warning. But armed with the right knowledge, you don't have to be part of that statistic. Stay tuned for the next video, where we'll dive deep into practical solutions. Until next time, this is Dr. Sarah Johnson, reminding you that knowledge is the first step towards a healthier heart. Part 2. The Warning Signs Most People Miss Top 3 Signs of Clogged Arteries in Part 1 We covered two early signs you should never ignore, cold hands and feet, and unexplained fatigue. But today's symptoms are even more dangerous because they're often mistaken for something else. Let's count down the final three. Number three, jaw, neck, or back pain. Especially during stress or movement, you may feel a dull ache in your jaw, neck, shoulder blades, or upper back, but you won't think it's your heart. These pains are often dismissed as muscle strain or tension, but according to the CDC, these are especially common in women experiencing heart disease. It's your body's way of sending out an SOS signal, but one that's easy to misinterpret. Here is the medical insight you need to know. Pain caused by restricted blood flow to the heart, known as angina, can radiate to these areas especially during exercise or emotional stress. Ask your doctor about a coronary calcium scan or stress EC guide. Both can detect early signs of arterial blockage. These tests could be the difference between catching a problem early and facing a life-threatening situation down the road. It's a chain reaction happening inside your body, and ED is often the first visible link. Why? The arteries in the penis are smaller than coronary arteries, so they show signs of poor blood flow years before a heart problem surfaces. So, what should you do? Don't wait. You might feel a sense of heaviness in your chest, like someone's sitting on it. Studies show that many heart attack survivors felt this sensation for days or weeks beforehand, but didn't think it was serious enough to warrant medical attention. If you feel anything unusual, especially combined with the other signs we've discussed, get checked immediately. An EKG cardiac enzyme test, or CT angiogram, can make all the difference. Medical screening. Better food. More movement. They work, because the most dangerous heart attack is the one you didn't see coming. These tests might seem inconvenient or even scary, but they're nothing compared to the alternative. Oh. Or maybe it's a mild, tight belt sensation that comes and goes. Some people experience discomfort after meals or when lying down. Others mistake it for heartburn that doesn't respond to antacids. If you've experienced any of these five signs, don't wait for pain. The nerves that serve your heart can also connect to your jaw, neck, and upper back. It's not uncommon for women to experience a heart attack without any chest pain at all. Instead, they might feel like they've pulled a muscle in their back or slept wrong on their neck. When your heart is struggling, it can send pain signals to these areas. The blood vessels in the penis are like canaries in a coal mine. They re often the first to show signs of trouble. Are you carrying extra weight? Do you smoke? How's your diet? These factors don't just affect your performance in the bedroom. They're impacting every blood vessel in your body. Take action now. Number two, erectile dysfunction. A vascular warning sign this may surprise you, but erectile dysfunction is often the very first sign that your arteries are narrowing. It's not just about intimacy. It's a red flag for your overall cardiovascular health. Many people worry about seeming foolish or wasting a doctor's time. But trust me, no healthcare professional would ever be upset about checking a potential heart issue, even if it turns out to be nothing. A heart-healthy diet, regular exercise, stress management, and good sleep habits are your first line of defense. Know your numbers. Blood pressure, cholesterol, blood sugar. These are key indicators of your heart health. Seek medical attention promptly. Time is crucial when it comes to heart health, and early intervention can make all the difference. It might not be the dramatic, crushing pain you see in movies, but it's just as serious. Your heart muscle is struggling to get the oxygen it needs, and it's sending you warning signals. But when it comes to your heart, 
It's better to be safe than sorry. It's information you won't want to miss. It's time to return the favor. Listen to your body, make healthy choices, and give your heart the care and attention it deserves. Because when it comes to your heart, knowledge truly is power. Stay tuned, stay healthy, and keep that heart of yours beating strong for years to come. A diet rich in fruits, vegetables, whole grains, and lean proteins can work wonders. Regular exercise, even just a brisk 30-minute walk each day, can make a significant difference. If you smoke, quitting is one of the best things you can do for your vascular health. According to Harvard Medical School, men over 40 with ED are at significantly higher risk for future heart attacks. Think of it this way. ED equals endothelial dysfunction, which equals impaired circulation, which equals heart disease brewing. It's packed with practical advice you can start using today. But here's the good news. You can fix your blood flow, not just the symptom. These patterns can provide valuable clues to your doctor. Improve your vascular health through lifestyle medicine, a Mediterranean-style diet, better sleep, stress control, and nitric oxide-boosting foods. These changes don't just address ED. They're investing in your heart's future. Number one, mild chest pressure or weird discomfort. It's not a sharp pain. It's not dramatic. But it might be the most dangerous signal your body gives. Here is the crucial part. These could all be signs of unstable angina, major red flag for an impending heart attack. Don't make that mistake. The signs are subtle, but they're not silent. Your body is speaking, are you listening? Small lifestyle changes. Here's what I want you to do next. Watch our upcoming video on three foods that silently clog your arteries and what to eat instead. And please, subscribe to our channel and share this video with someone over 40. Remember, prevention is the best treatment. Your heart will thank you for it. Now let's dive deeper into each of these warning signs and what they mean for your health. Jaw, neck, or back pain. The silent messenger. When we think of heart problems, we often picture someone clutching their chest. But your body is more complex than that. For women especially, these symptoms can be the primary sign of heart disease. Don't ignore these signs, especially if they occur during physical activity or times of stress. Your body is trying to tell you something important. Erectile dysfunction. More than just a bedroom issue. Let's talk frankly about ED. It's not just about sexual performance. It's a window into your vascular health. If you're experiencing ED, especially if you're over 40, it's time to look at your overall health. The good news is that addressing ED often means improving your overall health. Mild chest pressure. The danger you might dismiss, we've all had those moments where we feel a little off. A bit of pressure in our chest that we brush off as indigestion or stress. That mild discomfort you're feeling could be your heart crying out for help. Pay attention to when these symptoms occur. Do you feel them when you're exerting yourself? When you're stressed? After a heavy meal? Speaking of doctors, don't hesitate to seek medical attention. It's taking action. Your heart's future is in your hands now that you're aware of these warning signs. What's next? First, take stock of your lifestyle. You're giving your heart the support it needs. Next, schedule a checkup with your doctor. Even if you're not experiencing symptoms, regular screenings can catch problems before they become serious. If you are experiencing any of the symptoms we've discussed, don't wait. Remember, your heart works tirelessly for you every single day. In our next video, we will explore the foods that might be silently damaging your arteries and the heart-healthy alternatives that can help protect your cardiovascular system. So, hit that subscribe button, share this vital information with your loved ones, and join us in our mission for better heart health.